All right, here we are at the Galactic Zone. Let's check it out and see how it is. Star Control, investigate the battle site. Ooh. <coughs> Don't leave anything behind that might be useful. I don't know how useful this is going to be, but... Lots of dead people outside, that's not a good sign. Diana's log, ah. Diana's log. Read Diana's log, okay. <clears throat> Gotta be a miscellaneous somewhere. Don't know why it's looking through the other other things. Tiana's law going down the tea. I really must put these away sometimes, especially spend some nuclear tickets. Which you don't really need anymore. Tiana Tiana. In us log. That said, we're heading out to the Galactic Zone again tomorrow. Still not sure about how I feel about the salvage runs. It's amazing to see all the old tech still works. I just wish I could stay and study it and all, but Dad's crew is going to they to rip it apart and haul it back for scrap. As if the world didn't have enough of rusted metal and broken circuit boards already. Uh, at least I only have to, uh, take half shifts. Looking forward to getting back to work on Star Control. Just hope the old mainframe's still running. Yeah, I wonder who these guys are. Okay, what do we get? Yeah, it doesn't say who she's with. It's all my fault. I told them, I told them there weren't enough was left to turn it on if he had waited an hour we could have pulled them from around the zone gotten star control back up and running already had people looking i could have made it work but he wouldn't listen he wouldn't listen and now god i hope he's all right i can hear the screams we're going to wait for nightfall then make a run for the gate with enough cores left to turn it on, if we waited an hour, we could have pulled them from around the zone, gotten back to star control, and got it back up and running. So the star control. Interesting. Star control, which you can get up and running, and why would you want to do that? Presumably to disable what kind of security or uh, random... Nasties are around here. Ooh, a sniper rifle. Electromagnetic cartridge. Action sniper rifle. Buff out. But yeah. If we look here, it seems that several robots uh, died killing these people. Yeah. I guess we're fighting those. Man. Kind of weird that none, none of the humans survived. Yeah. Automatic laser pistol. So they're using laser pistols, it seems. Let's see how lasers fare against these. You never know. Whoa. Whoa. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dude, they just, just came out of nowhere. Zero chance to hit. Okay, it's like right in front of me, dude. Whoa, what's that? Nuka Cola Sentinels. Ooh, that's nasty. What's that? Laser does nothing to him. That's not good. What's the laser working? Oh, it is working. Okay, I just gotta hit him more. That's nice. He stops at the gate. That's nice and cheesy. Nice and cheesy. Those sentinels are really tough. This might be like the hardest zone. Let's see if the last, best will last, huh? Is it just continuous? Gotcha. Come on, get up. She gets up on her own, so I don't need to do nothing. Oh, it's more dead people. Great. Some nice materials here. Oh, a vacuum tube. That come in handy. Lamco, mac and cheese. Oh, yeah. Dirty water. Nice. Mind about you. Right away. Maybe there'll be some radiation inside. I'm not sure. Souvenir. Let's check inside. We got like really like a good few robots there right from the get-go it looks like it's packed packed with friendly robots shoes ruined at the barnyard animal petting zoo pick up a new pair at the dry rock gulch gift shop for only fifty dollars we should stay hidden <laughs> Um, I certainly didn't like that like we pulled all the robots from this entire area so they attacked together. Hello, Mr. Froth Frosty. Oh, we're in danger. I like attacking on mass again. At least the eye bots are easy. Still in danger. What's Good grief. I'm not sure how we're supposed to explore. It's, oh. So we got, let's see, we got star control, which is what we kind of want. Nuka galaxy is this way, but it doesn't really lead to anything. Oh, stairs. Feeling nostalgic or something? It did say it did say we need to get the uh the cores but i have a bunch of cores and they mean special kind of cores maybe i think we should go possibly that's star control star port yeah so i think i think we should look for the other cores maybe rather than just go there and put in my own cores which you probably can't do anyway so let's let's clear the, clear it out Come with me to the majesty and the pageantry of King 
Oh, 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 oh. Who, who's there? Oh, it's a uh, guardian. Yeah. Oh god, Gutsy. Oh, frothy, I mean. Another Mr. Frothy. Mr. Frothy. I wasn't expecting to be attacked from behind like that. Is there another Mr. Frothy. Ooh, new mods are available from workbenches. Nice. Interstellar Theater. What? What? Activate? Ah, how is that? Whoa! Oh, good. It's one of those things again. Where is he? Oh, he's down there. That's definitely the toughest one. Alright, we got him. Ooh, it leads up here, look. Ooh, Jesus. Damn, so many robots in here, man. No cause yet. Oof. These guys are relentless. And they just don't stop coming. I wonder if they're being produced. I hope not. That would be bad if they're being produced. I just let us go up to the uh, starport. I want to go there just yet. And let's check out the theater. Maybe there's a core in there. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. I'm going to check this out. It's going to be oh, scary. It's like the way they come at you. It's like, ah, I mean, they're just robots, but man. Okay, we're in. Eh. Why are they shooting at, I wonder? I hear shots. Um, Which way is the way in? I have no idea. Oh. Yeah, he went down fast. There's more. Yeah, it's, it's, I think what. That sounds like a, that sounds like a bad robot. Run. 
Is it dead yet? <laughs> oh my god, what was that? What was that? That was a scary robot. Oh, oh my god. Just exploded. Man, that was a tough robot. He took so many grenades. Oh, it's full of lasers. I actually kitted this armor out to be resistant to rate lasers. I'm still taking a battering here. Go away, laser turret. Okay, that's one down. Where's the other turret? Oh, God. Oh, there's another robot up there, dude. There's another robot up there. Hoping Kate gets off a butt soon. I don't want to waste a stim pack on her. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Kate, get up. She's gotten up. Where is she? Where's Kate? I've lost Kate. Where's she gone? Oh! Dude. Ah. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Good grief. Like, every corner there's a new, like, deadly robot. I'm getting some nice robot stuff for my workbench. What the heck is this? Uh, like a bunch of plungers. Cap stash. I think someone was living here and used plungers to get in and out. I don't know. That's weird, man. Ooh, a tooth case. Good stuff. Nice. Nosh. Shotgun shells. Don't really need an automatic combat shotgun. It's only 69 damage as well. But I do have lots of space. Took the liberty of, uh, Unloading some crap and I have a bit more inventory space this time around. Looks like I uh I need it. There's uh, so many excellent materials from here. Oh look. Like uh one of her friends. There's the star core. We needed that. Man, if I didn't look in here I wouldn't have found the star core. Do I have a quest for this? Do I have a, a natural quest for this? Star control, locate, locate the star control. But what about getting all the cores? Maybe, oh, so I'm supposed to find the star control first and then look for these. How about I find these first and then get to the star control, then I'll save time. Uh, or maybe I'm messing it up. I don't know. Ooh, nice stash of medical supplies here. Yes, uh, taking some, taking some drugs before the end. I see. Excellent. Get them tickets in. There was a, a guy up here. Where's he gone? Oh, wow. We get to watch a, a movie at the theater. Nice. Hopefully it doesn't get interrupted by another one of these. 
Star Tender, why they got missiles? Why are these guys so tough? Anyway, let's check out. Oh. It's the th the swamp thing. Out of the mist and slime. Out of the mist and slime. What time before history of man? <laughs> Birth from the deep of Earth's unexpected course. Comes an abomination science cannot comprehend. To menace the earth. Because going for a hot chick. An attack. <laughs> and that's it, it just leaps. <laughs> well, that's that's better than no movie, I gotta say. Ooh. Jingles the moon monkey. Burger trays. Nuka Cola. Lunchbox. EB dinner tray, is that aluminium? Aluminum? Aluminum aluminium? Yep. Ooh. Some really nice loot, at least. Does this do anything? Ooh, another star core. How many cores do we need? I suppose if we, if we went to the core, we could find out, like, how many we need. Sylvania Sloth toy? Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, dude. Imagine coming here, like, in the... Although, why would you go to a movie theater in a theme park? I don't know. Seems like a time-consuming activity. Is that all there is to this place, or is there more? Let's find out. Ah, oh, there's one. the two laser turrets in the cafeteria it doesn't make any sense bread box oven mitt ooh found the pantry key nice what's uh, where's the pantry some dirty water some Salisbury steak Ah, oh, this is the pantry, apparently. Full of lasers, yes. Jeez. <laughs> Ancient... Like... This stuff is like... Owl. <laughs> and we got another core, so that's three cores we got now. Wonder how many we need. It'd be funny if we got all three that we needed. Or is there four in here? Huh. 
That seems to be it. Some ancient meat there. That seems to be everything in here. Ooh, a safe. Almost missed that. Expert safe, of course. That's it. Fancy hairbrush sheltered there. Yeah, you can keep the pistol. Hmm. This where's this go? Going down. Going down. Main floor. Oh, this is gonna be Main floor. This is gonna be bad, isn't it? Going down. What's in the basement? Upper level. Oh, it's the upper level. Okay. That's cool. I think we clear the upper level. Uh oh, Mr. Handy Fuel. Yeah, so Kate must have taken care of this guy already. That's good. Well done, Kate. I see you languishing down there, not following me as usual. Ooh, a crystal decanter. Oh, that's nice to get. A full dinner set. What else is up here? Anything good? An office desk fan and some duct tape. Take that. That was good to get some more duct tape there seems to be a lot of rubbish oh a mop there's nothing behind here no okay this is just scaffolding to i don't know dust these planets what's this room though is this a projection room doesn't say what it is what does it lead to uh oh. Can I like sneak in? Uh oh. Please stand clear. This is now a free fire zone. I was hoping I could sneak in and turn him off, but it doesn't seem like you can. Oh, another core. So there's four. Four cores in here. I've just deactivated the projector. Oh, well. We had seen the movie anyway. Which was like the world's shortest movie. Got it. this improved targeted boosted agitated improved automatic laser pistol go on then i'll take it it's probably absolute crap and this is where we deactivate one of the robots ah oh, program schedule halloween's coming up and that means sci-fi horror madness month theater sure the following hollows are loaded and ready for first shoring Beast with a trillion eyes, death comes singing, shot too sly, the slimening yikes, there's a blood everywhere. <laughs> Nuka monster, atom bomb, shot too sly, week three, insects ate my baby, my husband, the mutant, shot too slime, slime doesn't pay, slime three, slime doesn't pay, night of the fish man's revenge. <laughs> um... Oh, what was that other thing? Memo from the management. I want all of you lazy jerks to get off your butts and clean the theater after each and every showing. I came into the theater this morning and several rocket pods were filled with trash, Nuka-Cola bottles, and who knows what else. Nuka-Cola doesn't pay you clowns to watch movies all day. They pay you to work. And if you notice the star tender breaking glasses again, please let the management know. Spent thousands of dollars on glassware in the last few months. 
Ever since the geniuses running the park decided to have a robot with no hands mixing drinks. I'd also recommend not getting it angry. Whether you trust this whole star control system or not, it's AI. Yeah. Okay. Well. Is there any other way out of here? Hmm. Nice. I don't think we're the dam in here. Ah. Almost, almost left without this. That sounds crap. Any technical documents? Nope. I, th down. I thought it was going to lead to the basement. I was like, oh, well, they're keeping it in the basement. Main floor. Not a lot, apparently. Unfilled kickball. Feeling nostalgic or something? Yep. Should always get some cash for that, I suppose. Yeah, it seems to be it. That seems to be the whole place. Nice. Yeah, that's pretty fun. Maybe we should go to the uh to the place we're supposed to go to. I'm thinking I think we probably should. Cause I've got I've got four cores and we'll be able to see how many cores we actually need. Um We have killed most of the most of the park's robots already, I feel. Like I feel like I've killed a lot of robots. Uh let's go let's go to where we're supposed to go to, shall we? I think it was pointing at this building. Um, where's Kate? She's coming. Oh, she's so slow. She's like the slowest companion. Hey Kate. Point out what you need and I'll get did you know you're the slowest companion at following? For some reason. I don't know why they made you that way, but... Just a reminder for our guests that tonight's bounty Can you carry all this junk, please? That's it. Okay. You can't carry much, either. Maybe I need to put you in a power suit so you can carry more stuff. Okay, so... If we check the map, the map's pointing at this building. So let's, here we go. Who could call a victory? Nice. All of a sudden, I bought. <laughs> Mm, there was something in here that broke out, apparently. Vault alarm. Sending down. Hmm. I'll break it open, apparently. Yeah, I wonder how many uh, cores we need. There's one. Yeah, how many do we need? Oh, do I hope we don't need them all, because it would take us forever to find them all. Hey, a helmet and a and a flag. All clear. Thank you very much. Any other goodies? A Braxo cleaner, always nice. Nothing in the first aid kit. in here electric zone managers key that will come in handy 
And the manager's terminal. Because we can't control anything from here, even though it's, it's manager's terminal. Experiencing all sorts of minor control malfunctions in the older robots in the galactic zone. Nothing serious yet, but if the star control ever loses its connection with these robots, I'm not sure what they'll do. I think our hardware is far too behind the software to have star control run the whole show right now. Oh, does he want to shut down? We really need to shut down the galactic zone for a major overhaul before we have a catastrophic failure. Crisis on our hands, Sydney. Uh... Dark Control was never meant to handle this many robots at one time. We keep getting asked to add more and more older models to the system. Tired of fixing the robots and getting the play nice with Star Control. And a yada, star control gets the six sticker, blah blah. Penny, I'm about penning. I'm one day away from quitting if you don't get some real help around here. Got six units offline again today, and fixing each one takes almost our entire shift. Ingrid and I are putting in 60 hour weeks just to keep things falling apart. I'm gonna look. Get it together or I'm walking. Mm. So, uh, problem with the robots and disgruntled staff. I thought this would be ele elevated down, but there's no elevated down. Uh, so I guess we gotta t just take the stairs then. Weird. Oh, we can unlock this gate. Combination wrench. Bone cutter. Whiskey. Trip time. Pork and beans. And some crisps. Very good, very good. Uh oh. Approach and identify yourself. Law-abiding citizens will not be harmed. That's what you say, Bozo. Yeah, I guess I'll, like, take the stairs down. Because we need, we need to get in there. Hey, there's a nice workbench there. Unidentified intruder detected. Beginning search. Ooh, there's some new armor there. Look. How do we get that? All clear. Let's go check out the mainframe, shall we? No star core is detected. Minimum of one control core is required to initialize emergency operation modes. Okay. Minimum required one. Okay, let's uh Ah. How do I how do I load a core? Ah, there's a gap. There we go, we installed some cores. How many do we need? We need a lot of cores, actually. Oh, a tape. Come on. 
working on a Nucatron when these damn kids came at us with their thirst zappers. Of course, they got soda all over the exposed hardware. The Nucatron lurched and pointed its nozzle right at one of the boys. I thought for sure he'd trigger the military protocol, and we were all dead. Turns out Star Control sensed the glitch, but we never had to find out. It shut down the Nucatron itself. God, I was so relieved. I still think having armed robots in the park is insane. As far as I'm concerned, this Star Control's the real deal. Emergency operations mode. Okay. Uh, operating instructions. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Build CVC. Highly redundant interchangeable telemetry modules. Okay. Communication interlink. Okay. Technicians log. Finished install for the new mainframe. Yep. Star control may be overkill, but at least there's still some redundancies if things go wrong. Still working carefully, never happens been done. Digging through the control code to verify the that the defensive mode protocol admin wanted seems to be in place. There was a major emergency. Some we'd flip the system into defensive mode and use the robots to secure the park. There's no real way to test it, right? So they had it so it would defend the park. Still doesn't make any sense. Why well, you'd have a theme park needing that much defense. Uh, if the main train tour is a bit mm, lucky, yes, lose our workspace. Right. I'm going to start interrogating the robots at the junkyard into the system. This will be, Oh, integrating. I'm not sure if it'll work. Kindle's log. Finally broke through the rubble around the north gate. Walked right in. No turrets, no combat, but nothing. The only robot... I had to put down was a damn Nucatron tried to sell me a $10 bottle of Nucatron. Here's the real prize though. On top of the line, pre-war tech still humming along. Bill Tina says these glowing things are redundant. Which I guess means we can take them or to fetch a good price back in town. All those gangs took Nucatown. We got survivors incoming. Had a boys throw up some defenses, so they ain't gonna last long. Told Tina to turn on that defensive mode she told me about. She panicked, said we taken too many cores from this thing. It couldn't handle the reboot. Sent everyone she could to find the uh, strip cores from the other rides. Still means well, but with the gangs breathing down next, I gotta do something. What's the worst that could happen? Yeah, the worst that happened is robots kill everybody. Ah, here we go. Six installed. There's a total of 29 other star cores. Oh my goodness. Uh, five in the Galactic Sound. So it's like a treasure hunt. Seven in Nuka Galaxy. Zero in Starlight Theater. So we got all the ones in the theater. That's good. So we need 29. 6, 12, 17. Yeah, we need almost all of them. Man, that's going to be like a treasure hunt. And... You better believe we need, we need a good amount. As Kendall, good old Kendall, the, who is responsible for this mess? Yes, slaphead. Oh well. Imagine, imagine being responsible for all those deaths. What an idiot! What a, what a maroon! How do we get in here? That's what I want to know. I want to get in here. How do we? Uh, how do I break this? I 
I guess it opens at some point. I don't know. It does look Area like secure. very nice armor. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it off here. This part is uh, definitely a lot more to it than the previous one. Uh, it looks like it's going to be a two-parter. I hope you've enjoyed this episode, guys. I know I have. Uh, this has been quite promising so far. We've got at least, like, uh, three enemy types, which is a great improvement. And it's been quite challenging, and we've taken a bit of damage. But thankfully, I have armor on that's resistant to lasers, so I have a slight advantage, thankfully. Because I, I thought I'd be encountering some sort of robots here. I just didn't know, like, this many. Uh, so it should be pretty challenging. And, uh, yeah, we just go on and go on a treasure hunt and find all them cores so we can reactivate the mainframe. Anyway, guys, till next time.